We're changing it up today, and I have one of my favorite people joining me, Mr. Justin Cody Warden, the co-founder of Modern Media Network, my business partner, and one of my best friends. Come on over. We need like a handshake Ooh. or something. Oh yeah, we should have had a handshake. Oh yeah. Is this the hot seat? Warmed it Ooh, up. Just it's a little warm. It's a little toasty. Who was in this before me? Uh, that would be Mike McChristie. Ooh, you take it easy on him? I think I took it pretty easy on him. He killed it, honestly. Nailed it. Yeah. And I mean, look at this. How awesome. Yeah, you know, I shot my first birdie ever right on that 18th green. Did you really? I can't even lie. I was no, I'm terribly golf. Sure I can't even do it. It's a total lie. It is a lie. I've never played here before. So are you saying I have a chance to beat you in the putting contest later? Putting contest? I didn't know about this. Yeah, that's the game. You did know about oh. it, don't play me. All right, so super excited to have you here. I don't know that I've really ever interviewed you before. Long, long time ago on the radio, I think. Maybe. No, I don't know. Wow. Well, it's gonna be interesting. I mean, if so, it's like four years ago. Hit me ago. with the good ones. Okay, so like true Claire fashion, you gotta hit me with a fun fact. What's something people may not know about you, Cody? So we've done this before. So people know we're both from Ohio. Met in California, but grew up like 30 minutes apart. Yep. That's crazy, right? Um, let's see. The universe see. is cool. Yeah. Uh, if you follow my social media, you know I have kids. Fun facts, Cody. Fun hit facts. me with something fun. You hear all these people say these fun things. How about you pretty got? badass? Okay. So yes. check this out. After I finished up college football, after my uh, sophomore year, I actually did MMA. Like straight up cage ball. I'm only laughing because you sent me a photo of this once and I didn't believe him. I really didn't I believe did. you. I got in a cage and fought another man it multiple times. <laughs> another man. Did you win? Like, what was it like? Were you I won my first it? fight. Okay. Yeah, but I fought like an older dude. Okay. So and you I got think a he little... took it easy on me. Yeah. I think I was just a superior athlete. But now I do the <laughs> MMA, like these guys are pure athletes. Like they train for MMA from like the day they're born. So it's I couldn't even like compete. I could, I can't even open the cage anymore. I mean, Cody, you just don't see you being that aggressive with someone, honestly. Yeah, they call me the pretty boy. <laughs> the truth comes out. It was out. kind of embarrassing. Like, you're yeah. like MMA, his nickname, pretty boy. Like. No, but hey, ask our friends that we know that we've done business together. They've seen the videos. Okay. John, you're over there. You've seen the video. I have. Yeah. It was pretty good. I don't know if we trust Cass, he's your friend. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so fun fact, you used to cage fight. That's good. We'll definitely put a photo of that up in uh, post-production, so ting. Um, <laughs> let's talk modern media. So we've okay. definitely gone through a little bit of changes. We launched yeah. the business a little over 90 days ago. I'm gonna let you get people up to speed on what are we doing? What's modern media all about? Yeah, you know, that's a, that's a great question. I'm glad we actually are going that route. So a lot of people ask like, Recently, we changed our name. We were Climate Media Network. We switched over to Modern Media Network. You know, we were very fortunate when you and I took a complete leap of faith, decided to jump out on our own and, mm -hmm. you know, just see what could happen. You know, we have the opportunity. We work with anyone we want. We get to work with amazing people. We get to share great stories, yep. whether it's real estate agents, business owners, nonprofits. And the most important thing, we get to film on amazing locations like this. For a golf course of this caliber to open up their arms, just let us come in there and pretty much take over. Like, yeah. what an honor. Truly. Um, but the most important thing, we when we decided to do this, you know, we met with some good business partners. We teamed up with a great company called Climate Media. You know, they're a production company, mainly mm -hmm. up this way, Orange County, yeah. in LA. Yep. And they really built the foundation and helped us launch this business. You know, we made it through that 90-day launch period and it was time to rebrand. It was time for Claire mm -hmm. and Cody to take the training wheels off and go full steam ahead. That's right. And now we have Modern Media Network. We have a great crew, we have a production team, we have a director and Carrie Bryant, you mm -hmm. got obviously the one and only Claire McKee hosting our shows. And I just get to twiddle my thumbs and talk about numbers, which is great. <laughs> so speaking of numbers, let's talk about what were you doing before we teamed up? Like, how did this all come to be? What's your background? Funny background. So going into college, I thought I was going to be like a pre-med doctor, pedi pediatrics, work with kids. And mm -hmm. um, I did a like weekend internship my soft going into my sophomore year of college at the Children's Hospital in downtown Cleveland. And I spent the whole weekend there. I'm, I was gung-ho doing all my biochem, organic chemistry classes, knocking biology out of the way, yeah. playing football. And then I went and did the weekend overnight and when you go to the children's hospital, do you know who the kids are that stay overnight all weekend long? They don't. They're the ones that are really, really sick. Yeah. And that Monday I walked into my counselor and said, I am not doing med, I am going into finance. And yeah. uh, transferred to San Diego State a few years later, graduated with a degree in finance with a minor in chemistry. <laughs> Got that going for me. There you um, go. Yeah, you know, from there, you know, I walked into a great company right out of college. Uh, worked in financial services with the same company for almost 
10, 11 years. Which is kind of unheard right? of. People say millennials don't stay with a certain job for very long. Yeah. Debunk that myth. No, straight up. I mean, I was yeah. very fortunate. I mean, I was able to grow my career, um, not only professionally, but on a personal level with the people I worked with. Um, that led me into wanting more. I went into like more of a business development. From there, transitioned into mortgages. Um, gave that a shot and sure enough, here we are today running a media production marketing company together. So it's weird how the, the, the chips fall, but in the end you roll with the punches and you keep going and yeah. you know, we got a lot of great opportunities ahead of us. I know that I still think back to that very first day we shot our first shows at Stone Brewery and you and I walked out and we hugged and it could like literally bring yeah, a tear to my eye. <laughs> well, it's just one of those things. I mean, so many people get caught up in the entrepreneurial dream where it's like, I wanna do this, I wanna do this, I wanna do this, and very few people do it. And yeah. that's the one thing, like even with me having young kids and being able to take that leap of faith and decide like, hey, yeah. we're gonna start our own company. We are Modern Media Network. We wanna share your story. There's nothing we can't do. Right. You bring the dream to us and if you, want it, we'll find a way to make it happen. Yeah, there's no dream too big. And I think that that's really important. And honestly, how we've led this entire business from the start is just both feet in, full steam ahead, make the leap because we knew in our hearts this is what we were supposed to be doing. 100%, but let, let's switch it up. I'm gonna switch gears on you. Oh. Clara, you always get to do the interview. So let me ask you, like, what is your passion? Like, you've been in the real estate thing, you've interviewed real estate agents, mortgage brokers, loan officers, like, but we know Claire McKee is not all about real estate. So let's share the real juicy about what Claire McKee wants. I think my biggest passion in this world is just people being their authentic self. Like I feel like I'm on a mission because I've spent so much time really getting to know myself in that way and feeling super comfortable with who I am and just embracing that. And I know that that's something that's really difficult for everyone to feel super comfortable in their skin. And so I'm just super passionate about like leading with that, being my best self and hopefully influencing others to feel that they can be super comfortable in their skin, whatever that looks like. So that's totally my passion. I love passion. that. And what people don't know, Claire actually has the best life model. Like share your three favorite words. My three favorite words, like, no and trust. Like, no and trust, <laughs> I love it. What, what better way to, do, I mean, you start your own company and why do you do that? So you can work with people that you like, you know, you trust. Yeah, I wanted to build a family around us, right? Like, it's a family. I want everybody to rise together. I want to be friends with everyone we work with and to be able to create that culture and be surrounded by not only super talented people, but people who I know have my back and that hopefully know I have theirs too. I mean, that's the dream in my opinion. So I could not be happier. Absolutely. And the great thing about Modern Media Network is kind of a little play on words. People think TV, production, media, you got the network, network TV. But really what it's about is Modern Media Network's goal is to create a network of people that you can work with day in and day out. Bring people together using the power of social media mm -hmm. and media production, having all the cameras, the lights, the camera guys, carry behind the screens, and really just use this as a tool to bring all these different professional people together. Yep. We're filming a show right now with a golf course. Yep. We're gonna wrap this up and we're gonna kick into the next show on the block and we're gonna film 10 to 12 real estate agents in Orange County. We and get to tell our... stories about amazing people yeah. doing incredible things. We get to help them in their business, create content, promote themselves, and achieve the sale of the home that they have at the time. I mean, we're helping people in kind of a non-traditional way, but at the end of the day, media is taking over and that is the new tradition, right? Why not use it? Everyone's on social media, you might as well put something good out there. Yeah, yep. we don't even have business cards, right? No, no, why not? <laughs> Just find me on social media. Well, Cody, this has been so awesome. Um, can we do this a little more often? I think so. Uh... Next Tuesday? I thought you were going to be like, that's <laughs> going to cost you. I'll check my calendar. So let's see here. We got a putting contest going on? So we're going to do a putting contest. Um, you brought the rules though today. So I'm kind of leaving this in your hands. You're playing co-host. So All are right. you ready to go spit some fire? We're playing with like a club pro of the golf course. So uh, let's see what happens. You have to do worse than me. I mean, I'm scared. Okay. Okay. Stick with us. Putt contest coming soon. <laughs>